What's up guys, it's Thief Chief here and welcome back to another video on my channel. Today we have for you some insane team of the week investments that are going to help you make a ton of coins on FIFA 21. So if you are enjoying the content, please subscribe. Over 90% of you that watch my videos aren't subscribed and it helps me out a ton. And make sure to go check me out on Twitch, Twitter, and the Discord, all linked in the description down below. And make sure to drop me a follow or whatever you want on those platforms and with all that said let's jump right into these investments so first of all we're going to be looking at the new team of the week so if you guys don't know we do this video weekly basically we're just looking at the new team of the week and we're looking to invest in these team of the week cards that are in packs that are going to significantly go up in price when they go out of packs so some cards that i want to take a look at would be denayer um Maignan, the french goalkeeper um, Izzo is going to be a good one, I'd assume, Saiz, and then maybe Ruben Garcia as well, and maybe we look at Saka and see how cheap he is. Now, the first one I want to look at here is going to be the French goalkeeper, Mignon. He's 84 rated. Now, Team of the Weeks in general are kind of up in price right now, but these guys are still going to go up when they go out of packs, so these could still be very good value to invest in because generally these Team of the Weeks almost always go up in price when they go out of packs, which is why we do this video weekly and try to bring it to you. Now, for an 84 rated keeper, we're looking at about 22,000 coins, and honestly, I would personally stay away from this one i don't think it's great value at the moment maybe if he's down at 16 17 000 coins i'm picking him up but i just think this is too expensive right now and i'm going to stay away from him a card that i think could be quite good depending on his price right now is going to be this Izzo in for me could be a guy that we try to snipe as well because overall i think he's going to be a good investment yes he is dirt cheap this guy is probably going to be our best investment of the week here. This guy, Izzo, his gold team of the week. He's 13,000 coins for a Serie A Italian 82 rated center back. You can sit here and try to snipe him so you can get him for 13k or just kind of bid on him as well is always a good option. Bidding on these team of the weeks, you're able to pick them up for very, very cheap and get some good deals on them. So I honestly think Izzo might be the number one card to look for in this team of the week. He gets good links, he's good rating, and he's very cheap right now. So I think he's going to be a very good option to look at. Our next one, which I like a lot as well, but not as much, is going to be Saiz here. Uh, he's a Wolves center back for those of you that don't know and he's probably gonna be our second best investment Now you might be thinking he's not great because of his nation. Is that Morocco? Yes, it is Morocco Nailed it now you might be thinking because of his nation Maybe if he was English and from Wolves, we'd like him a lot Now the reason I like this Saiz a lot is because Wolves has a lot of fodder players They have Rui Patricio, they have Ruben Neves, and they have Jao Matinho Which are all key players that get put in SPCs a lot so so Saiz gets strong links to all of them and he's so cheap right now. We can get him for 12k pretty easily here, I'm assuming. So he's Premier League as well, which is absolutely key, very important here. And you could definitely pick him up for like 11, 5, 12 very easily. I think he's a really solid investment. Now, someone I was looking at earlier today, who is another person I would stay away from because he's just very expensive right now, is going to be this Denayer. Now, this guy has two informs. We're going to be looking at the 84 rated inform because that's the one in packs. And he is up like past 30,000 coins. He's very, very expensive. And he, he's an inform I'm just going to stay away from because he's a card that's solid in game as well. So that might be impacting his price. He's not just a card being put into SBCs. But as you can see, see he's just very, very expensive. He has hasn't even popped up here yet so i'm gonna stay away from denayer as well now another person we wanted to look at here apart from those two center backs that i think are really really solid investments um i believe his name was ruben garcia here let's go ahead i think this is a guy that might be like under 11k i mean you you maybe you go and pick up one of them and just storm in the club as a spanish la liga striker you just pick up one storm in the club hold him for later because he will go up in price it'll just take time however if you're planning on picking up a ton of cards holding them on your transfer list i would stick with Izzo and saiz but this guy is still a solid investment i just don't think he'll go up as much and for the price i just don't think he's as worth um picking up as compared to those other guys that are in a better position in center back because it gets used more than once per sbc um they get better links it, it, they're just overall better investments now outside of that i would love to look at this french goalkeeper bernardoni 
I think he could be a good option here. And then we'll also check out Saka just as some... Um, some last options here now this goalkeeper he's basically going to be one i stay away from unless he's literally like under 11k close to discard because otherwise goalkeepers i just don't find being worth it so this is something i think is worth it 82 rated french goalkeeper ten and a half thousand coins for him he discards for 10k worst case scenario i'm losing 500 coins on this guy he's literally perfect I love that investment. If you can get him for 10,500 and under, that's that's perfect. Literally just a great investment. That's all I can say is he's going to be great. And then the last person I want to look at, now these low rated informs typically struggle to go up in price. They don't go up in price a lot, but if they are cheap and they get good links, they're worth looking to invest into. Now Sokka at twelve and a half thousand coins, maybe thirteen thousand. Typically, I don't think is a guy I'm going to invest in again. I would stick with those two center backs we talked at the beginning, Izzo and Saiz. I think they're going to be the best investments here. And also picking up if you want to store like one of each in your club, getting a Ruben Garcia and a Bernardoni, the French goalkeeper, are going to be good options as well. But guys, that's going to be it for this video. If you did enjoy it, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll catch you in the next video.